Listen. You hear it, right? Sounds like a woman's voice. What do we hit? Hell if I know. I can't see a damn thing. Berto, hold the wheel steady. Greg! Who the hell are you people? Randall! Looks like you caught our thieves. Nice job. You know, every per person we find living, they got some dead with. Who was it for you, I wonder? Uselessness stops now. Time to earn your keep. Stop! So. You fucking shot him. I didn't mean to. Do you think that matters? Please. Please don't, don't, don't do this. Please. I didn't. I, I, I've, I've never killed anyone. Someone's coming. He... he shot Greg. He shot my brother. He deserved what he got. Th that's what I thought, but now... I'm no better than Randall. Than any of these people. They're here. Pete, and get the hell off this boat. Flare gun? Let's go. I couldn't get anything out of it. Zachary was useless. <sighs> These people just aren't talking. Yeah. Problem is, we still know nothing about them. I'll get them to talk. Don't worry. I have to worry. After last time... It won't go down like that. 
I swear. It can't. They see me gone, you haven't got a chance of getting out of here. Hey, Randall! You want to tell me how this happened? Zachary! He was guarding the door! Right. Samantha put you up to this? Where is she? Come on. Out with it. Probably headed for shore. I doubt she got far. Norma, forget about the girl. We can figure this out between us. I'd like that, Pete. But your friend here seems to have other ideas. Randall, sound the horn! Sure thing. Drop the machete! I said drop it while you still have- <laughs> <laughs> Figure it out. Michonne? I'll see if I can find us a ride out of here. How many are there? Only three. The hell out we might have to fight our way out. What? I think we lost him. For now. We won't. There's a boat we can use. We'll take them out if we have to. Them or us. No, we are not killing people. I'll give myself up. Paint! It buys you time to escape and no one dies. And I'll find a way back to you. I can reason with these people. That'll never work. Pete, they'll kill you. They won't. You start butchering their people. And our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. I'm doing what's best for my crew. That includes you. When you get your opening, run! We gotta stop him! Now! Hold your fire! I just want to talk to Norma. I hope he knows what he's doing. Come on, we gotta go. I think you might be telling the truth. Just keep him talking, Pete. All right! Keep your hands up. Take me to her, and we'll sort everything out. You've already stolen our shit. You're not taking our boat, too. You should look behind you. 
You think I'd fall for that shit? Pete. There's no way I can get back to Pete's boat. We can hide out at my house until it's clear. My dad can help you. It's not far. We'll get there before morning. Your dad? Why didn't you mention him before? I don't want Norma looking for him. I'll tell you more on the way. some distance between us and Norma. Okay. We can lose them in the woods. How are we gonna do that? It's not like we're just gonna walk through those things. Down. 
we walk. Stay close. Stay quiet. As long as we don't bump into any of them, we'll be fine. That worked. Just be glad it did. Take him down. Into the woods. Move. I'm not gonna like him. It's not as bad as it looks. I know the way up. This will work. How are we supposed to climb this? Carefully. Craig and I climbed it one by one. I don't think we have time for that. Follow my lead. Just move. Randall, I found him! This way! Go!
My house is up ahead. We're not far. I found Norma's place a while back, when it was just a couple of boats anchored to a pier. They had some supplies just sitting out, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. And, and now Greg is dead, because I couldn't leave it alone. But you stole from them again? I got greedy. We, we were desperate. Norm Norma, I... I never should have pushed her. This last time, I thought we could just hide this stuff on the ferry. But Greg, he... He didn't think it was safe. I, I should have... Listen... I'm dizzy. Thanks. You're not looking so good. I feel even worse. Talking helps. I, I don't want to black out on you. I'm trying not to. Your family. What are they like? Dad, Dad was a lawyer. So I never won any arguments with him. Uh, my brothers, James and, uh, and Alex, they look up to Greg so much. They're going to be destroyed. Dad was right. He said none of us should leave the house. Walkers are trouble. People are worse. I didn't listen. You knew the risk with Norma and you still took your brother. If we hadn't gotten food, we all would have died. Doesn't mean I don't regret it. I, I don't know. How am I supposed to tell my dad about Greg? It's gonna ruin him. I don't know if I can. When the time comes, you'll figure it out. <sighs> Made it. Sam. Sam. Sam, wake up.
Almost there, Sam. Almost home. <sighs> Don't fucking move! Not one more step! <sighs> Sam! Is she dead? Did you kill her? Answer me or I'll shoot! I'm not fucking around! Sam's still alive, but she won't be for long unless you let us in. <coughs> she won't. Sam? <laughs> Maybe you shot her. Then you'll come in here and kill everyone. I can't take that risk. So just put Sam down and leave. The longer you talk, the more blood she loses. God damn it. Ugh, fine, get her in here. On your left! <gasps> Sam? <sighs> Sam! <sighs> James, Alex, get back! Your sister's hurt! What's wrong with her? She's bleeding! Sam! This is bad. This is really, really bad. I need you to find help, okay? Uh, okay. <sighs> Dad! Dad! What's your name? I it it's James. Okay, James. You got a first aid kit? Kind of. Get it. Fast. Got it! What are you doing with that? Sam? Sam, I got you. I'm here. I need to clean the wound. Uh, Sam! Uh, is the bullet still in there? Didn't punch through. We gotta, we gotta get it out, right? There's too much blood. You're gonna have to use this. Hand me that. Not gonna lie, this is gonna really fucking hurt. Hold her down, you two. Saving her life. With that? Are you insane? Let me do this. I've almost got the wound closed. James, let me.
Is she going to make it? I can't lose her. I can't. I can't guarantee it. What? Tell me. What happened? You appear out of nowhere, with my daughter nearly bleeding to death? I saved Sam. Carried her through a walker-infested forest back to you. When Sam wakes up, we'll see what really happened. Look at me. I don't know who the hell you are, but... Dad! Dad? Where is Greg? Greg didn't make it. No. Colette? Elodie? You girls in here? You in here? What's bloody things?
You left this all behind. Dinner. No one ate anything, though. They're not. I'm alone here. When no one was picking up, I thought... God, I, I didn't even want to say it. I, I, I talked to Dominic earlier, but there was... There was screaming. Christ, it was horrible. I don't know if it was him or who, but... God, Michonne, he sounded so scared. The girls, too. Crying and crying. I couldn't stand it. Poor thing, they must be terrified. Why the hell didn't he call me, Donna? He tried, Michonne. Said he couldn't get through. We have to find them. They could be anywhere. And if we can't get a hold of them, I, I don't. Where do we? Uh, I don't. Hey, what are you? Oh, 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 please, please, don't. Donna, Donna, get out of there now, Donna. Who's Donna? Did you say Donna? You okay? Just thinking about someone I once knew. It's okay. I do that too. John, he... he went to talk to the kids, make sure they're all right, while I watched over you. Sorry about this. John isn't big on people he doesn't know. So what? You're my babysitter? Something like that. So, yeah, this is where I apologize for almost shooting you. Emphasis on almost. I was just worried. Don't worry about it. it happens more often than I like to admit. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not a great shot. That patch of dirt, his mom's buried there. The ear is so back, she just... She was sick. Not in the head. Something with her heart. She couldn't handle it, I guess. 
never understood that. I tried the same thing. But I couldn't do it. I've thought about it. How could you not? But like I said, bad shot. It wasn't for Sam. No. No, Greg. I just need more time. More. No. No. I'm here, Sam. Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. Sam, no. Mission, we have to help him. You're too weak. Move me up. Just stay down, Sam. I need to help him. You're hallucinating, Sam. I, I... Greg isn't here, okay? Sam. I know John can make a strong first impression, but he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Something that makes all this shit worth it. Yeah, fight until the day you die. I need a word with you. In private. Do you have children? A son? No, I... I don't. <sighs> it snowed the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. We erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. I'm really sorry for your loss. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids. But the past... It always seems to find you. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm. But we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's... I could really use your help. These kids deserve a real childhood. Some place where fear isn't the norm. If I can give them even a sliver of that, I'll die happy. I'm sorry, but our crew's still out there. I have to find them. Please, stay until morning. Perhaps you'll reconsider. <sighs> Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Or those, whatever they are. Yeah. 
Yeah, he did. My boy, I should have never let him leave. I... I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. But you have no idea what it's like to lose a child. I gave everything for that boy. Everything. And now he's gone. You don't know how that feels. Everyone's lost someone. You're lucky this is the first time. Lucky? How can you think that losing my son... Peekaboo.
must be pretty proud of yourself, huh? Caught yourself a golden goose. You think I'm shitting any eggs? Forget it. <laughs> Jesus! Whoa! You don't mess around. <laughs> I like that. Pete, where is he? Well, that fella liked talking so much, I gave him another hole in his head to do it with. No. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, want to get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. Are you gonna answer? Someone should. Yeah! Tell her my hands are vice stuff, and I've swallowed a pint of my own blood. You heard her. Randall needs to check in. You know, this feels mighty familiar. Except you're there, and I'm here. So, Miss Schoen, what do you want me to say to her? On account of me hoping to avoid more broken fingers, your wish is my command. Say something stupid, and you'll regret it. You sound just like my daddy. He was a mean son of a bitch. His belt was even meaner. So I learned not to cross his path twice. I'll play along. Randall! Yeah, I'm all right. I thought something had happened. Where the hell have you been? Lost. Yeah, just, uh, got turned around in the trees. Till we found a trail. Walker parts that led us straight to Michonne. She's in a house, southwest of the tower. So why don't you come, huff and puff, and blow this whole fucking place down? Little slow, Michonne. Little slow. Can't believe you let me keep talking. Almost got my whole life story out. Pick up the radio. Now. Oh, shit. Norma's storming now. Go on. Throw some words at her. I'm not fucking around here, kid. I have your brother. I gathered as much. I only want to know one thing. Did you hurt him? You so much as breathed on my brother, I'll find you and make what happened on the ferry look like a goddamn picnic! Know any good surgeons? I don't want to look into that. You bitch! This little game you're playing, I don't fucking like it. We'll be there soon. You know, this alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. Then Sam's, then yours. And last but not least, those kitties too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. I'm not letting you hurt anyone. Well, not until Norma gets here and I skip bare ass free out the front gate. And that will happen. Michonne. Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. <laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Sean? Is that true? 
Please tell me he's fucking with us. There was nothing I could do, Sam. No! 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 James! If he killed my dad, then why isn't this son of a bitch dead? First good question asked all night. Michonne's just been fumbling around like a bear cub fucking a football. He keeps opening his mouth. He'll be dead soon. We should do it right fucking now! You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! Well... <laughs> I ain't had the bell of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. Fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing me. Then you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You're right about that. Feels good to get that out in the open, don't it? Well, maybe. Maybe you think you can rise above all that. But there ain't no heaven up there, honey. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. Then you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. If you got a point, get to it already. On my way, darling. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. Or died in, or are in that walking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about them. Either way, they're suffering. And mommy isn't there. We all have our demons, honey. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have a purpose. Believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down. 